If you ever enter data incorrectly or just want to change something, you can easily edit data on your sheet. Let's look at several different ways to edit data. To replace all of the data in a cell, just click once in the cell and type over it. Even though we changed the number, the currency formatting still applies to the new data. To make a small change, maybe change this amount to 1000 instead of 10,000, double click the cell. Now we're in cell editing mode and can change the data directly in the cell. To move around in the cell data, use the left and right arrow keys or use your mouse to select specific data. When you're done editing, press return or tab to commit the change. To get out of cell editing mode without committing a change, just press Escape. Another way to edit data is to make the change in the formula bar. If you don't see the formula bar, here on the View menu, make sure a check mark appears next to Formula Bar. Click once in the cell and make the changes just like you did in cell editing mode. To commit the edits from the formula bar, press Return or click in another cell. To delete all data from a cell, select the cell and then press Delete. If you're using a MacBook, you will need to hold down the FN or Function key located in the lower left corner of your keyboard as you press Delete. Or if you prefer, you can use any of the clear options located here on the Home tab. But let's undo those deletions and move on to the next lesson where we'll learn to insert and resize columns.